And she told me she has a favorite show, and I want to find out what it is. You got a budget. Every girl needs a good hair tip. Stay tuned. Today we're in New York City, Times Square to be exact. We're going to Zoo Hair Salon where we're meeting the celebrity hairstylist Karen and Doing. She's going to show you how to get red carpet ready for free. You can't miss that, so make sure you stick around. Karen, I'm so happy to have you here on Beauty on a Budget. Can you tell us a little bit about what brought you from Los Angeles to Zoo here in New York City? Like, Tell, me some, tell us something about your journey. I just want to hear it. Well, I actually spent quite a few years working in Beverly Hills, and I really wanted to see what Manhattan had to offer as far as the salons, the clientele, products, treatments, and money. Stay tuned. We'll be right back with more Beauty on a Budget from Zoo Salon here in New York City. Frustrations, calculations. I'm here to help you find the perfect profit. So don't click that mouse. Next, I'm Beauty on a Budget. Tips is for my team viewers out there. Yes, I was once a team too, and I know about all those burning questions you have. So if you check out the Beauty on a Budget fan page, I'll answer all your questions on self-esteem, body image, and why your breasts are turning the sizes that they are. So make sure you check it out. and I'm your host of Beauty on a Budget. Tonight we're talking about ways to pamper yourself at home and the best at home exercise products that you can buy either in the store or as seen on TV. It doesn't really matter. I'm going to let you guys know. And obviously we have a lot more in store, so stay tuned. As always, we have Fashion with Fatima. Obviously this is Fatima. We have her here. She's talking to the audience out there. What do you have for us today? I love when we have this segment because I learn a lot from it and I try to steal some of the ideas she gives to you guys out there. So what do we have today? fashion thief. Okay, we are talking about patterns, huge patterns, polka dots to be specific. It's all the rave. It was a really big um, trend back in the 70s, but now this fall it's back with a little bit of glitz and glamour. Um, perfect for an after five gathering with your friends or your co-workers, but this pattern is definitely something you want to get a hold of for, this, for, for the fall 2011. All right, so now I feel a little bit weird because we're not wearing polka dots. I wish I would have known what we were doing. Then we could have matched up. We could have been the polka dot twins. I know this might seem a little weird, but I have come to understand that we like to appreciate our bodies while at home, and a way to pamper yourself is possibly buying a striptease video. Something you can do on your own, in the mirror, dim the lights, it'll make you feel sexy, and the great thing is you don't have an audience, so you won't feel embarrassed, or you can invite somebody over and have an audience. And you can either feel embarrassed or feel better. It doesn't really matter. That's another way to pamper yourself at oh, home. Well, what, was, what was your answer? I'm sorry. I said cover girl. Oh, I thought you said L'Oreal. Mm, it was Maybelline. Clearly he doesn't know what he's talking about, and he wasn't the guy from Blue Travelers, uh, beautician. Actually, it was Avon. And you're a moron, and you don't know anything about the beauty business. So, what do you have to say about that? I work at a salmon hatchery now. Great. Uh, but we'll still give him a prize because he's stupid and he should go home with a prize. Prize hand. Oh, wow, you, have a, got, a, you got a clock. You're like the white flavor flave. Excuse me. Hi, camera on me. Oh, thanks. 